I'm Katie Fessler here at Fessler Nursery. We've been in business since 1960, so oh, well over 50 years. We were founded by my mother and father-in-law, Ken and Marie Fessler. My husband, Marvin, my brother-in-law, Dale, and his wife, Janie, as well as my sister-in-law, Debbie, still help run uh, everything here today. We grow mostly annuals, bedding plants, fuchsias, geraniums, that sort of thing in the spring. We have a whole propagation division that we work uh, and root cuttings year round in the, mostly in the winter and then we have a whole tropical house plant division that we are involved in year round and then we also grow poinsettias for the fall and Christmas season. At Wilco you'll find our 10 inch, 12 inch and 14 inch baskets. We specialize in fuchsias, geraniums and hanging mixed sun baskets. Very colorful, everything you need for spring you'll find at Wilco. At Fessler's, we grow about 100,000 baskets a year between 10, 12, and 14 inch combined. Here's an example of our 10 inch color basket, the sun basket, and the types of plants you see here. We have uh, bacopa, light blue bacopa. We've got a white verbena, calabrocoa. In other baskets, you'll find petunias, osteodaisies, and of course, your fuchsia baskets that you'll always find at Wilco as well. Well, a premium flower basket would consist of plants that are only grown from cutting, not seed. Seed annuals are not as durable, they're not as hardy, they're not as disease resistant. So when you grow from a cutting, the breeders have bred these plants to perform better in all conditions and to have beautiful bloom color, bigger blossoms a lot of times, new and exciting color combinations, and a lot of times you don't have to deadhead, which is really nice, which you do have to do with seed annuals, but with these premium cuttings, not necessary. A Fessler basket takes approximately four months from beginning to end, from the cutting stage all the way to the finish stage where it is shipped and then presented at your Wilco store. Once you get it home, you're gonna to want to put it in the proper environment, shade for a fuchsia, a little bit of diffused light for a fuchsia, uh, more sun for obviously a sun basket. And then make sure you're fertilizing weekly with a good all-purpose water-soluble fertilizer that you can find in your local Wilco. And just keep an eye out for pests and bugs. You can get aphids, thrips, sometimes budworms just kind of a normal part of the growing environment. Just keep your eyes open for that. 